Hello everyone and welcome to the fourth episode of my Metal 12 inches. Well, I think it, it's the fourth. Uh, anyway, when I was uh, finish, uh, finishing up my previous episode of this, uh, I said that uh, I had now shown all of my 12 inches that I bought during the 80s, but uh, I actually had forgotten three of them because I keep those three slightly uh, separate from the rest of them. Uh, first one was a 12 inch picture disc of Iron Maiden's Flight of Icarus, which I'm not going to show, uh, but these next two I will show. Uh, these are by Anthrax. This is uh, Indians, uh, back with uh, Sabbath, Bloody Sabbath, and Taint. And uh, I don't actually remember what is on on the poster, so let's have a see. Ah, so, <laughs> so it's the front. Uh, it, it's not that long ago that I've actually listened to both of these, but uh, uh, because I can pick up the single from between the sleeves, so I, I haven't had to look at these. Uh, the second one is uh, I Am The Law, back with uh, I'm The Man and Put E Love Bomb and Sidney's Lounge Band. Okay, so let's see what's on this poster then. Ah, okay. So it's again this Chuck Spread poster. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, I didn't buy a lot of Anthrax during the 80s. I actually bought only these two singles and the Penico uh, Fishing EP. Uh, didn't buy anything else during the 80s. Okay, so let's move on to the more recent purchases and I checked this. And I bought this uh, first one. I bought this uh, during the Christmas of uh, 2016, so there was about 25 year break when I didn't buy any metal 12 inches. So this is uh, Now You're Gone remix back with uh, Kittens Got Claws and Cheap and Nasty. And this one is gatefold and it includes the uh, booklet. Okay. Then next one is also White Snake, Fool for Your Loving, back with slow poke music and Walking in the Shadow of the Blues live. And I remember buying this one because I was about to make my White Snake singles video and I thought that I had bought this during the 80s, but it turned out that I hadn't. So needed to fill up my collection because I absolutely hate that that cover ver cover version, that remake version. Okay, next one is uh, Metallica, The Unforgiven, back with uh, Killing Time, which is Sweet Savage cover version, So What, which is anti nowhere League cover, and demo version of The Unforgiven. Okay, next one I remember being very surprised to find this, uh, because it was only like a couple of weeks earlier somebody showed this one. Uh, and I was like, okay, so there's that kind of a single too. I didn't even know about it. And then I found it a couple of weeks later and it only cost me five euros. So this is uh, Gary Moore and Friends, Nuclear Attack. Uh, that's on the inner sleeve, that one there. Uh, back with uh, Don't Let Me Be Misunderstood and Run To Your Mama. Okay, another Metallica 12 inch. This is uh, Enter Sandman, uh, back with the Stone Cold Crazy, which is a Queen cover and demo version of Enter Sandman. Yeah, I was really lucky with this uh, Metallica 12 inches because uh, I usually don't see uh, two, two of the Metallica singles that I see very commonly uh, are Creeping Death and Jumping a Fighter. Uh, Creeping Death I still, still don't have because it's always very expensive. Uh, but these are other ones I don't see, but uh, I found this uh, Metallica 12 inches uh, from the records, uh, record fair in fairly short time. I, I think it was like within a year or so. Okay, next one is uh, Ozzy Osbourne, Mr. Crowley, live, back with You Said It All, uh, unreleased song and Suicide Solution live. Next one was also a very surprising uh, found find because uh, I hadn't seen this one before and this was very cheap. Uh, I remember being 
very surprised because uh, Iron Maiden singles are usually very expensive. This is the Wicker Man, back with Power Slave and Killers live versions. Okay, this one is Metallica 1, back with For Whom the Bell Tolls and Welcome Home Sanitarium live versions. Uh, this one I didn't fi uh, found from the record fair. Uh, I actually just watched this video uh, prior to making this video. Uh, does anybody know uh, uh, if the song was influenced by the movie which is show shown in the video or was it the other way around that they wrote the song and then somebody suggested using the clips from the movie within this video. Absolutely one of the best videos ever made. Okay, next one is Dio, Hungry for Heaven, back with uh, Holy Diver and Rainbow in the Dark live. This one was one that bothered me for at least 20, 20 years, uh, wondering if I already have that one or not. I mean, because I have a, a picture disc of that one, so I, I was wondering if it's the same or not. Okay, next one is in actually a 12 inch, this is a 10 inch Iron Maiden reincarnation of Benjamin Brieg, back with Trooper and Run to the Hills Radio 1 Legends session. And this one is on clear vinyl, and this, yeah, there's also a, a sticker. I showed this one because uh, I keep this this single within my 12 inches. Okay, next one is Metallica, Wherever I May Roam, back with Last Caress, Am I Evil, Battery, live version, and demo version of Wherever I May Roam. And final one on this one is the Def Leppard EP, which I remember be, being <laughs> very high on my want list on this uh, record store day, and I didn't find it at first, uh, and I didn't really think I would because I thought that this would be immediately sold out. But uh, like, luckily, short time later, I found this. Uh, I don't remember like uh, how much later. Maybe it was just a few days, but anyway, it was after record store day. Yeah, uh, that's it for this episode. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you like this. Leave a comment.